In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to use the color wheel to select and paint with colors that are warm. I've created a drawing of some chairs for you to color. I've drawn the fruit on one of the points in the rule of thirds grid. Dividing any image into thirds is the best way to place important objects in your compositions. We'll use the warm colors in the palette wheel to color in our drawing of chairs. Warm colors are the yellows, oranges, and reds. Warm colors are the colors of the sun, fire, and desert rocks. These things are usually hot and make us think of exciting, dynamic, dangerous experiences when we look at them. I've given you the bucket tool. Completely fill the two chairs with the yellow I've selected. Have you always wanted to create works of art like these? Well, you can. Hi, I'm Remy, and I'm your personal art tutor. I'll guide you through each lesson of art school. I'm gonna show, let's get started. I'm gonna show you how you can create your own artwork using the amazing UDraw game tablet. If you ever wanna review any part of the lesson, just press the back button. Let's get started by creating a drawing that is entirely your own artistic expression. It'll loosen you up for the lessons to follow, and it'll be fun. To start off, I've given you the whiteboard as the canvas for your drawing, and I've selected black from the palette wheel. We want a smooth white surface so we can see our drawing lines clearly. Okay, now I've chosen the crayon to get us started. Listen to this music. How does it make you want to move the stylus? Watch how I am letting the rhythm and the sound tell me what marks to make on the canvas. Now it's your turn. The lines you create on the screen should express your feelings about the music. Our expressions will look different from each other. The side will be in shadow. Sketch in the core shadow Let's change the color of the crayon to white. Start smoothing and refining. Now I've made the white more transparent. See how I keep the... Add the brightest highlights by over... Your drawing is complete. You've in this lesson, I'll teach you how to draw a teapot using a technique called chiaroscuro. Italians use this method during the Renaissance to create beautiful paintings. We'll start with a dark terracotta crayon and a canvas filled with a medium terracotta tone overlaid with a grid. Let's begin. Thank you. 
Fill in the shape of the teapot. Use the grid to help. Squint at the photograph of the teapot. Look at where the... Continue to build the dark slowly. Next, we'll add the three secondary colors, orange, green, Notice that each secondary color sit. Now let's blue and green make great. The co complementary colors and green. Thank you. 